Wake up, it's 2030, and AI is everywhere. It's in your home, your car, your job. Hell, it might even be your best friend. We're talking AI assistants that know you better than your mom, humanoid robots making your coffee, and self-driving cars that actually drive themselves. And get this, by 2030, AI-driven job loss will be a massive issue, with entire industries transforming overnight. Civil unrest? Protests? Oh, they're coming. Today, I'm diving into the wild future of AI. Will it be our savior or our downfall? Get ready, because I've got some juicy predictions to tell you. All right, let's kick things off with how AI will be part of our daily lives. Today, the average person might use AI to ask Siri about the weather or get Google to find the nearest pizza place. But by 2030, this is gonna look like child's play. Imagine waking up and your AI assistant has already prepped your breakfast, scheduled your meetings, and even picked out your clothes. You'll have AI tutors for your kids, AI therapists for your mental health, and AI lawyers to fight your parking tickets. Sounds crazy, right? but it's not far-fetched. Experts predict that AI will be as common as smartphones are today. We'll interact with AI like we do with other humans. They'll be our personal assistants, career counselors, and yes, even significant others. By 2030, it will be normal to have an AI partner, cheaper, faster, and more reliable than any human could be. The transition will be gradual at first. Some people will jump on the AI train immediately, while others will resist, thinking, hell no, I'm not talking to a robot. But eventually, it will be inevitable. AI will be able to do so much more efficiently and effectively, making it impossible to ignore. They'll become indispensable in our work lives, handling everything from coding to customer service to making strategic business decisions. Now let's talk about robots, and not just any robots, humanoid robots. By 2030, expect to see over 100,000 humanoid robots deployed in the real world. Today's robots can vacuum your floor or assemble car parts. But the robots of 2030, they'll be like us. Why? Because our world is designed for humans. Doors, cars, tools, everything is built for human use. So for robots to seamlessly integrate into our world, they need to look like us. Tesla is already working on a humanoid robot named Optimus, expected to hit the market by 2025. Elon Musk has said, Optimus will ultimately be worth more than Tesla's car business. That's a bold claim, but when you think about it, it makes sense. These robots will handle jobs that are dirty, dangerous, or just plain boring. From working in factories and warehouses to serving in hospitals and homes, humanoid robots will be everywhere. They'll do the heavy lifting both literally and figuratively. And with companies like Figure and 1X Technologies already making significant strides, it's only a matter of time before we see these robots in action. Picture this, you walk into a store and a humanoid robot greets you, helps you find what you need, and even checks you out. It's not science fiction anymore, it's the near future. And the best part, these robots will be constantly learning and improving, making them even more useful over time. Now let's dive into how AI is going to shake up various sectors. First up, smart cities. By 2030, AI will be the backbone of urban development. AI will use cameras and sensors to watch over the city, predict accidents, and even stop crimes before they happen. It will also help manage things like electricity and water to make sure we don't waste them. Next, let's talk about school. AI will change how we learn and how teachers teach. Instead of teachers spending hours grading papers, AI will do it in seconds. AI tutors will help kids learn in ways that work best for them. No more boring lessons that don't make sense. AI will know exactly how to help each student. It's like having a personal tutor for every student 24-7. Healthcare is another big one. AI will help doctors find out what's wrong with patients faster and more accurately. It will suggest the best treatments and even predict who might get sick again. This means better care for everyone and lower costs for hospitals and patients. Now on to money. AI will change how banks work. Imagine never having to wait in line at the bank again. AI will help with everything from managing your money to protecting you from fraud. It will also help banks make better decisions about investments and loans. Transportation is going to be wild too. Self-driving cars will be everywhere, making roads safer and traffic jams a thing of the past. AI will control traffic lights, optimize routes, and even park your car for you. Media and entertainment will be no different. AI will personalize your content from movies to news. Platforms like Netflix and Spotify will get even better at predicting what you want to watch or listen to. AI will also help create content, generating articles, videos, and even domestic service robots will get a major upgrade grade. They'll handle chores, assist in hazardous environments, and gather and analyze data. These robots will work in retail, hospitality, healthcare, and even agriculture. They'll eliminate risky and repetitive tasks, making life easier and safer for everyone.
Now let's talk about the elephant in the room, jobs. Everyone's worried about AI taking over our jobs, and guess what? They're not entirely wrong. AI-driven job loss will be a massive issue by 2030. From customer service agents to accountants, data scientists to security guards, AI will be doing it all. Just last month, Klarna announced their new AI system is handling the work of 700 full-time human agents, and Ternitin is planning to cut their workforce by 20% in the next 18 months thanks to AI advancements. This isn't some distant sci-fi scenario, it's happening right now. Why are companies so eager to jump on the AI bandwagon? Simple. AI does things faster, cheaper, and more accurately. It's a no-brainer for businesses looking to boost profitability and productivity, but for workers it means a harsh reality check. Entire job categories will vanish, and new ones will emerge, but not fast enough to absorb all the displaced workers. This imbalance will create tremendous near-term pain and dislocation. Expect political movements and leaders to rise in fierce opposition to AI-driven job loss. Civil unrest and protests will become common, and they won't won't always be peaceful. The debates over policies like universal basic income will move from academic papers to legislative floors. Everyone will have an opinion, and those opinions will shape political and social identities. If you think politics are chaotic now, just wait. Next up, let's talk about the evolution of AI concepts. Terms like agents and AGI are all the rage now, but by 2030, they'll be outdated relics. Why? Because these concepts will become so integrated into AI that they'll no longer need special labels. Agents are AI systems that can handle loosely defined tasks. AGI, or artificial general intelligence, refers to AI that matches or exceeds human capabilities across the board. But here's the kicker. AI isn't trying to be human. AI is different, and that's its strength. Jan LeCun, one of the big brains in AI nailed it when he said, there is no such thing as AGI. Even humans are specialized. By 2030, AI will be mind-bogglingly powerful in ways we can't even imagine now. It will excel in areas we humans can't even dream of mastering. The term AGI will become irrelevant because AI's capabilities will be so far beyond our own in certain domains. Think about it. If an AI can understand and explain human biology down to the atomic level, who cares if it can't make a perfect cup of coffee? The concept of matching human intelligence will seem quaint, almost most laughable. So, the million dollar question, will AI overtake us? Well, it's complicated. AI will definitely become an integral part of our world, influencing everything from how we work to how we interact with each other. But will it overtake us in some Terminator-style apocalypse? Probably not. AI's growth will bring both risks and benefits. On the one hand, AI can solve problems we've struggled with for decades, making our lives easier and more efficient. On the other hand, there's the risk of misuse, ethical dilemmas, and job losses we talked about earlier. The key here is balance. We need to manage AI's power and potential responsibly. Governments, companies, and individuals will all have a role to play. It's not about fearing AI, but understanding it and steering its development in a direction that benefits humanity. So, no, AI won't overtake us, but it will definitely change the game, and it's up to us to make sure it changes for the better. To wrap it all up, AI in 2030 will be a game changer. It will be everywhere, transforming industries, reshaping job markets, and evolving beyond our current understanding. AI will become a powerful tool that, if used wisely, can enhance our lives in ways we can't even fully grasp yet. But with great power comes great responsibility. It's up to us, yes, us humans, to guide AI's development and integration into society. The future of AI isn't just about technology, it's about us and how we choose to shape our world. If you enjoyed this video, do me a solid and hit that subscribe button. This channel is new and your support means the world to me. It helps me keep making videos like this for free. Remember to share your thoughts in the comments. How do you see AI shaping our world by 2030? Let's get the conversation started and remember, the future is what we make it.